guys, it's Ross, and uh, today's video, we're going to show you guys a plant that I decided to grow for the first time this year. It's called Gallengal. I actually got this plant from my buddy Big Bill, and the thing grew actually pretty well. Um, you can see down here that it got hit with a frost, so it's not doing too great, but what's underneath is the important part. You can't eat the stems. It's a relative of ginger, relative of turmeric, I believe. So it's, you know, most of it's edible and it grows in a very similar way that you can honestly plant this just like this and here's a new shoot that would come out. And I kind of want to leave this in the ground to see if it would be perennial here. There's a lot of talk and even people that grow uh, plants like this, turmeric, ginger, gallon gall, they grow this here in zone 7, even people are doing it in zone 6. I know of a farm that's actually doing this in Jersey and selling this stuff for quite a bit of a premium. So if you have the ability to grow this where you live and you're interested to grow this kind of stuff, it's well worth it. You can get a nice premium for it. Um, I want to show you, we did get to kind of try this raw. It's not really that good, I'm going to have to say, but it's more of a mild form of ginger. But if you did grow ginger, um, you can certainly eat that like this and it's much more pungent much more powerful a totally different ginger than you can get in the store this i don't even know where to get this so this is quite interesting for that purpose next year we're going to do some ginger we're going to do some turmeric um, and see really what we can do with it certainly very easy to grow and it, but it takes a while to get started you plant one of these rhizomes you could and then it, it just will take a, the whole season really to spread once it spreads, it starts shooting up new shoots, and from there it takes off and you've got a pretty good crop. So, a bit of a long season crop, but you can certainly make it work in Zone 7 and Zone 6. And we're going to leave this in the ground, like I said, to see if we can overwinter this. And we'll probably try to do the same thing with uh, turmeric and ginger next year to see if uh, we can do the same thing. Because if I can perennialize this, you know, I don't eat ginger and turmeric all the time, but... It would be nice to be able to go in your backyard and just dig some up and have some whenever you want. So, anyway guys, that's Gallon Doll, and hopefully you enjoyed this one, and I'll catch you all for the next one. Take care.